Welcome back to the Tennisshare channel. If your iPhone's stuck in recovery mode and you can't restart your phone, I know that sinking feeling. Don't worry, we got you covered. We got two more tricks for you to exit recovery mode without data loss. And if you've ever had this happen, let me know in the comments what worked or didn't work for you. Let's go. To prevent operational errors, try a forced restart first. This is the go-to fix for most system glitches, and it's really easy to do. Click volume up button, then volume down, then press and hold the side button until the Apple logo appears. Once you see the logo, let go of the button and your phone should return to normal. If this method doesn't work, try this new trick. iPhone 15 and 16 users can exit recovery mode wirelessly with another iPhone running iOS 18 or later. Just keep clicking the power button until the Apple logo blinks really fast. Then let go of it. Wait for a while. Then you will see the Apple logo fade in and out. The wireless restore page will appear and a pop-up will show on the other iPhone. Tap continue and enter the verification code. And choose exit recovery mode And that's it, no computer needed. Okay, if this is not working for you due to weak connection, you can use a computer-based tool to exit recovery mode in one click. Rayboot is an amazing tool that lets you exit recovery mode with just one click. All you need to do is download the software onto your computer. It works on both Windows and Mac. Once installed, connect your iPhone to the computer. Open Rayboot and click exit recovery mode. Within seconds, your phone will be back to normal. And the best part is, you won't lose any data. But what if exiting recovery mode isn't enough? Sometimes, your phone might need a system repair to fix deeper issues. Reboot has you covered here too. You can use the standard repair option to resolve system problems without erasing your data. Just go through the process will be okay. Your phone will be fixed by Reboot and get out of recovery mode now. If none of these methods work, it might be a hardware issue, especially if your phone has been dropped or exposed to water. In this situation, I recommend reaching out to Apple support for professional help, instead of trying DIY fixes. And that's it. Hopefully, one of these methods helps you get your iPhone out of recovery mode. If you found this guide useful, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more tips and tricks. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.